everybody, I'm Brady with Golf Ascending, and if you haven't yet, please subscribe. We do create weekly golf content, and today we have a guest, and it is Cooper Nelson. He is a junior golfer here in Utah, and he is a two handicap, and he actually has a YouTube channel as well, so make sure to check it out. We're doing a little collab, and he is gonna have a little competition video on his channel with him versus Tyson. But we're gonna do a little course vlog get, showing you Gladstone Golf Course in Payson, Utah. It is a beautiful course. The back nine is in the mountains. Unfortunately, it is smoky today, so it's not giving it the justice it deserves because it is a beautiful course, but we'll show you the course, and he's gonna also walk us through a few different holes on how he strategizes, how he plays, and you know, kind of get in the mind of a junior golfer here, so let's go to it. Hey guys, uh, here out at Gladstand with Cooper here. Um, we've decided that we want to talk to him about kind of what his strategy is on how he approaches, you know, a par three, a par four, and a par five. We've selected, um, you know, not the easiest ones, a little, some with a little bit of difficulty, but Cooper's gonna show us how, right now, we're gonna attack this par three and what he does. So um, we're gonna get over to Cooper. All right, so this is hole two at Gladstand Golf Course. It's a par three playing 167 yards over the water. Um, there's a bunker in front of it that you really don't want to mess with or in water on the left. So I usually just take a club that's usually five yards more and play it right to the middle of the green. All right, so I'm going to be using a seven iron. I usually hit a seven iron about 175, and so that's going to play about seven yards over the pin, which is really good because you really don't want to be short to this pin. Hole 10 at Gladstone is definitely a strategy hole. You definitely want to aim just left of that white tank right there and that will set up about 140 yards into this tough green. All 
right, so we teed off from clear up there and ended right here. We have 79 yards left into this pin and we're hoping to knock this one close. Hole 18 at Gladstone is a long par 5 with an island green. You want to place your first shot right up the middle of the fairway as far as you can and have a good second shot in. Alright, so we hit that drive really good and we've got only 165 yards into this par 5. So I'm going to take a 7 iron and make sure I get it on. This is the closest I'll ever get to walking Hogan's Bridge. Tapping birdie? Tapping birdie. Tap Eagle would have been nice. Take it. Nice. Good job. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Um, as you guys can see, Gladstand Golf Course here in Payson. Beautiful course. Um, definitely check it out if you guys are in the area. Also, check out Cooper's Instagram and social media. He does a lot of stuff there and his YouTube channel. But if you guys like the video, make sure to hit that thumbs up, subscribe. We upload golf content every week, and we'll see you next time.